Jeff Wilson here with Austin Thud Hubbard. I have a really cool walkout song that you come out to. What's the name of it and who's it by? So I'm walking out to a song called At My Leisure by Stilo Bass. And it's uh, actually one of my buddies. Um, we worked up in uh, a warehouse together uh, in Loveland, Colorado. And, uh, you know, he, he's a rapper and makes music and he's very good at what he does. And, you know, I was uh, fighting, you know, trying to, we're both trying to make it to make it big, you know, make our dreams come true. And uh, we both said, kind of had a deal like, once one makes it, we'll turn around and help the other try making it too. So, you know, I, I keep walking out to his music to, you know, try helping him get exposure and getting his name out there and get people listening to his music and, uh, you know, trying to keep my promise, you know, doing anything I can to help him. I, I love that. And it's great. Uh, and get lonely at the top. And you are on that meteoric rise up there. It's great to take people with you. And you are fighting Joe Selecki at UFC Fight Night on August 22nd. Man, I'm looking forward to it. I'll be yelling at the TV for you. Before we get into that uh, fight, uh, there was an interesting thing that happened in your last fight with uh, Max Roshkoff. Sent a really cool message to him after. Because just for the fans that are watching right now, if you guys didn't see that fight, um, Austin knows how to make people suffer in the ring. Uh, and he actually didn't come out to start the third round. Uh, I think Robin Black and I had a conversation about it and some others, and we were just sitting there and we were like, we know that guy would rather, you, you either, you know, um, come back victorious or die in your shield. And you know that bothered him for a long time. You, you yeah. sent him a message. It was really cool. Do you want to talk to me a little bit about that? I told him just to keep his head up. Uh, you know, everywhere I've seen, mostly like online and uh, all the like news outlet, MMA news outlets and stuff, you know, the comments were pretty harsh and uh, things like that. And, you know, he, he's young in his career. He's, he's still a young fighter in his own right. Uh, he's, he's a very talented fighter also. And, uh, you know, I, I just told him to keep his head up and don't let the people, the, the negative things, the harsh things get him down. Uh, he has talent. He's um, just to not get discouraged. You know, every fight is a learning lesson, you know, just take take what the lesson you learned and grow from it and continue on, you know. Yeah, it's very cool, man. A lot of guys wouldn't do that. And uh, that's uh, awesome they did. So uh, Joe Selecki coming up. Yeah. So, yeah, we were supposed to fight, actually, the fight I fought, uh, Max. I think he got sick is what I heard. I'm not entirely sure he, he had to pull out the week of the fight. Um, and then, obviously, the Max fight happened, and now here we are again. So, um, yeah, everything is going great. Training has been uh, going really well, and uh, definitely looking forward to getting back in there. I'd like to stay active. And, you know, for me, I feel like uh, the best place to learn is, you know, why you're in there live and going getting after it so i'm excited to step back in there uh, i love watching you fight you have such a great attitude and a great style um with the way that you fight thanks yeah, so much yeah. for taking the time